What I'm going to talk about is using the Choose function in Excel with the radio buttons. Here I'm just showing you what the product is going to look like. So we're looking at vacation room rentals here and so uh, they've selected the suite and you see that the suite rents out for somewhere between $150 and $250 a night. Now if they wanted to um, choose a double instead of a suite you see that you see that the rate is 110 to 150 or if they wanted a single what the room rate is 95 to 110 now this is easy to do with the use of the radio buttons and the uh, choose function so what we're going to do is we're going to go to sheet number two and I'm going to go on my developer tab to our toolbar our toolbox here and I'm going to drop the list arrow and I'm going to select the radio button and I'm going to go down here and I'm going to enter it give enough room here and uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click and I'm going to edit text and so this would be single Okay, and then I'm going to click away and I'm going to right click again and I'm going to format control. And so I'm going to pick, um, I'm going to click on this red arrow in the dialog box to close the window and I'm going to pick, pick um, let's say K5 here and I'm going to have the control going there. And so we'll close that and we'll say OK to our window. Or our, our dialog box, I'm sorry. The next one, so I will continue to enter these um, these radio buttons. So here you see I have the three radio buttons selected in here. Now, um, we selected K5 as our, as our button for the indicating for these. So let's click single just so we can see where our K5 is. And you can see that there's a one there. And if we unclick that and we click the double, it goes to two. And if you click on the suite, it goes to three. So if we're going to uh, enter the room rates here, K5 is our button that changes. So I'm going to select the choose function here and the index value is the value that we're getting as a result of these dialog boxes being checked. So that is the K5 so I'm going to click on that one. Okay so if the first one is selected they'll need the room rates for a single room and so I'm going to go um, room rate And let's say ninety-five dollars to a um, hundred, hundred and ten dollars. Okay, and so the second option is going to be um, it's going to be more than this. It's going to be room rate is going to be um, one twenty. To um, 150, let's say, and the third option is the suite, and so I'm going to go suite rate, and I'm going to go um, 160 to 270. 75. And I'm going to say OK. So there you have it. So now you see the sweet rate is 160 to 275, but you've changed your mind. Maybe I'll change, go to single. Or how about a double? And the room rate keeps changing every time you select a different, a different option. And that's by using the radio buttons and the choose 
the choose command. Please subscribe.